so um i have been <clears throat> doing I've, I've done a bit of thrifting over the past two weeks and i was thinking of doing a little haul and then doing like how i would style the items that i bought so most of the things that i've bought have been off yaga um which is like this south african like it's like a it's, it's an app that sells secondhand clothing which i would consider like thrifting so i'm gonna start most of the things are from yaga there's like two other things that i went I thrifted at like shops and stuff, at like secondhand charity shops. So I thought, let's get into it. So the first thing I got in terms of, well, this is not really a top, but it's like a fleece, like without like, how do you describe this? It's like a fleece top, it's like those puffer things that it doesn't have arms, which I thought was really nice. And I could like layer like tops and stuff underneath of it. Um, I think I would, I would layer like a white t-shirt underneath of it with like maybe a pair of jeans or something um and then so I'm first doing tops now and then I love this top so much it's so cute it's like this little knitted top you can see over here it has a nice little lower back um and I think I'm trying to think of how I would style this I have maybe a pair of jeans or a pair of like jorts like, like very neutral colors because this is quite busy um but yeah and then i also got a bit of like a few basics just because it's summer coming up and i didn't feel like um i want to get a few basics but i also didn't feel like going to cotton on even though a, like a few of these things are actually from cotton on but like I'm, i got them secondhand off yaga so this one's really cute it's um a little bit it's like lacy um and it's just a really nice basic to like style with like literally anything like i'd probably style it with a pair of jeans or something for like a simple little outfit um next i got these two th the next th two things are so cool they're like graphic tops and they have like they're i don't know what material it is i think it's cotton where it makes it like a bit of polyester but like it's so cool because it's like eyes and stuff on them and that one's an orange and then i got this one reminds me of like a What's the band called? I think like TV Girl, like some, one of their like album covers. Like this is what it reminds me of, which I really liked. Like it's very, it's simple, but it's also very different as well. Um, so the next few things um, are gonna be like bottoms, like pants and stuff. So these ones I didn't get off Yaga. Um, I have such good luck when it comes to um, thrifting pants because I do the thing where you put the waist around your neck and it works every single time. And if it can fit like more, like just your, just to the back of your neck, or like just a little bit more than your neck, that means I'll fit your waist. Um, so these are like a corduroy, like low waisted jeans, which I really love. Like I love corduroy and they fit so nicely. I think I would might pair it with the white top, um, with the white little lacy top that I showed just now, or with one of the graphic t-shirt um and then next i've really been wanting a mini skirt and i just like haven't been able to find one at like normal stores so i went like i went on the hunt to go find one and i found this really this is actually from cotton originally from cotton on it's like a little ribbed mini skirt with like some ruching at the bottom and you can actually tie it to fit your waist which is really cool um and it's a really nice length on me i think i'd do it with one of the graphic tees and then maybe some stockings, like black stockings underneath of it. Um, yeah. Also, all these items were like under like a hundred rand or under, which I think is amazing. But that wasn't including shipping, because shipping on Yaga is either 60 to 50, like 15 to 60 rand, depending on the size of the order. This isn't I wish this was sponsored by Yaga, but it's not. Yaga sponsored me. Um, and then I've been in my jorts era. Like I, I'm like loving this jorts trend trend. Like I ordered another pair of jorts, but they haven't arrived yet. I was just so impatient. Like I really wanted to do this video, um, but these are the cream, the cream jorts. I don't know what brand they are because it says they're made in Lesotho, which I think is really cool. I don't know what brand they are, but I think I pair this with like that green knitted top. I think it would look really cool. So yeah, so I'd pair it with a green knitted top. And some like I think I'd do most of these, like pair most of these with some Converse. 
And then the last thing I got, I've been wanting a very lightweight leather jacket. Um, just like wear out when I like go out clubbing or something. That's like not too, especially during winter, when I go out during winter. Um, yeah, so it's like a, it has like a few scuffs, but it was only 110 rand. So I'm really not complaining. Um, so this is what it looks like. Like it have you has I think I'd probably style this with the mini skirt um, and like the graphic one of the graphic tees as well. Um, it's like a navy blue kind of like you can kind of see here there are a few scuffs but like it was quite cheap so I'm not complaining. Um, so I think now I'm gonna do a little thing about like how I would style them and also like I. Do it like a lot of my shopping that I do for basics is normally from Cotton On, but it, they've gotten so expensive recently. Like it's literally, and I can in like Cape Town and South Africa, like there's not many places to go shopping other than Cotton On or Factory or like those types of shops, um, unless like you can find diff like different things when you go like thrifting and stuff like that. But sometimes, especially in Cape Town, if you go to observatory, it's really overpriced. It's usually what you would pay for it. It's usually what you would pay for like a normal shop so yeah i was really very happy with the things that i bought um but yeah